Okay, so not me popping up on here <laughs> like it hasn't been forever. Literally so long. Um, girl, life is crazy. So, yeah. But um, I really did miss you guys. And if you don't follow me on TikTok, then you really haven't seen me anywhere because I don't post on here, obviously. Um, my Instagram is inactive. Like, I cannot stand Instagram. I don't like anything Instagram stands for. Not that anything came out. I just hate the fakeness on Instagram. I hate the vibe on Instagram. It's too showy. It's too flashy. It's too fake. It's not realistic. We all know. So, girl, me and Instagram, I just can't. I can't. So, um, anyway, here I am. And like I said, I missed you guys. Yeah, so today is September 21st. Today is my oldest sister's birthday also. Um, so yeah, anyway, I'm in Suburban Square and I'm about to go to Sephora. I was supposed to go to Lululemon, but I forgot my pants. I wanted to exchange my pants for a different color. I forgot them. Literally, as I'm parking, I'm like, girl, where's the pants at? I forgot them in my closet. So <sighs> that's okay. I think I'm coming back up here on Friday. So either i'll do it on friday or if not i'll just do it by the lululemon by my house um but yeah i'm about to go into sephora just because i want to like see some fragrances i'm like itching for a new fragrance so i don't have any perfume on that's why you didn't see me put perfume on because i like coming in here with nothing on my skin so that i can like spray my body with everything and then see which one i like and then come back and get it um and just browse around and see what's new i haven't been in sephora in about a month i think a month or so um, and then I'm gonna go to Kava, it's right behind me, to get some lunch. And then Whole Foods, because I'm gonna try this recipe tomorrow with y'all. Um, and I just wanna go to Whole Foods, see what's new in there too, see what it's hitting for. So yeah, it's um, a work day, a content day, but also like a, kind of like a chill day, I guess. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna head in here and stop rambling. But like I said, I missed you guys so much. Like, trust me, like, you guys asking me on TikTok, like, am I finished with YouTube? Did I quit YouTube? One of my posts, like, I, it, girl, trust me, like, I be feeling so bad, but I gotta put me first. Like, I wasn't feeling it. I wasn't feeling it. And life was life, and life is still lifing. So, you know, it is what it is. Um, the show must go on. So, yeah, anyway. Let's get into it. I'm going to uh, try to film in here, but you know Sephora would be acting funny in a little store. You can't really record in here, but um, yeah, I'll see what I can do. But like I said, miss you guys, love you guys, and let's get into this vlog. It was like crowded outside at Kava and then it was like loud inside. I was like, this is just not the vibe. So, yeah, I'm like, I came back here to the deck and when I came back, it was like shade, no sun. So on my bowl, I get the saffron rice, right? And then I get the hot harissa chicken. What is it? Yeah, that's what it is. Hot hot honey harissa chicken or honey harissa chicken whatever it is that's what i get then i get um tomatoes and cucumbers i get more tomatoes then i get pickled onions and avocado corn a little bit of crumbled feta i get uh crazy feta crazy feta is so good they sell it at um whole foods now so i'm hoping when i go after this they'll have some at my whole foods and um and then i get hot harissa hot honey harissa vinaigrette on top and it's so good every time i door dash this i always 
forget to put avocado on it so like i'm so happy to finally have avocado on it because honestly it makes it let me show you guys a little bit better and i'm sorry if i can't even see me because of the damn sun So it is um, the next day. I'm currently getting ready. I have so much content that I need to film. It's like actually crazy. Um, I'm like I'm like very anxious about it. Um, I hate when everything kind of like lines up around the same time, even when I try to avoid that from happening. Um, so last night I got an email from one of the brands that I'm working with and um my video is approved to go live today at 1 30 p.m so i have my alarm set for that so it can go live on tiktok um and then another brand reached back out and said they wanted me to change like um something in my video so i have to like refilm a portion for that video send it back over to get approved i think yeah it has to get sent back um and then, you know, hopefully it can go live tomorrow. Today's Thursday, so maybe tomorrow because they wanted it up this week. Um, then I have one, two, two other brands that I have to film for. Um, yeah, one has to go first. And then the other... And then what else? I have to reply to some emails. I feel like I'm missing something. So refilm for that one brand. Get that brand knocked out the way. Get that brand knocked out. I might do that brand tomorrow. Yeah. So one, two. And then I also have, um, I got a package from Jason Co. And I still don't know if I'm saying the name right. But I worked with them last year. Or they sent me stuff last year. Um. And their stuff is really good. It's just a clothing brand, but the clothing is like bomb. They have bomb basics. So she sent me over this set, which what size is this? Medium? This cute cream set. Oh my god, these are the cutest, okay? Cutest little shorts. And then it goes with this shirt or this top, this crop top, which might be, it might fit, it might be a little big. See, my thing is when it comes to sets, I need a medium in the bottoms, but I'm a small in the tops. Like, y'all know I have no boobs, so I need all my tops in the small, but I kind of got a booty and I got thighs, so I need my pants in the medium, but it's kind of like iffy. So when I when I get sets, I need a medium just, so be, just to be safe, just to make sure it fits the bottom, and then I can kind of like finagle the top to work. So it goes like this. It's super cute. So they also sent over this two piece set this is so cute i'm gonna wear this um when i'm filming for my other sponsorship so i have to film for this too because they want me to post a video so i got this jacket and it comes with these leggings these are super cute and all of her um pieces they're like a really thick material and then she sent over this top so, like I said, I also have to film, like, me trying these clothes on. So, yeah, film one, two, three, three videos, because I'm going to do that other one tomorrow. Um, and then we have to go to the supermarket later, because our dogs are out of dog food, and we are out of some stuff, too. So, yeah, it's just kind of like a busy work day. Um, I'll let you guys watch me... Uh, film and stuff um so yeah day in life of a content creator if i wrote you a symphony just to say how much you mean to me what would you do if i told you you were beautiful would you date me on the regular? Tell me, would you? Well, baby, I've been around the world, but I ain't seen.
myself another girl like you. This ring here represents my heart. But there's just one thing I need from you. Say I do. Because I can see us holding hands. I have the first set on. So I'm ready to take the pictures. So, um, it is really cute though. The color, she knew. She knew. Not to send me nothing, but neutrals. And then the one color that I actually do like. <laughs> so, it is really, really cute. And you can definitely wear this out. If you want, like to run errands and stuff, it's super cute. You could even dress this up if you wanted to. But let me start taking the videos um, so that I can knock this out. It doesn't help that I'm bloated because my period is like two seconds away from coming on. It was supposed to come on yesterday, either yesterday or today. So. I'm guessing today will be the day. Okay, next set. This is so cute. Thumb holes and everything. I'm not really like the biggest fan of thumb holes, but I like when stuff has thumb holes. Thumb holes. Thumb holes because it means the sleeves gonna be super long. Like I love when my sleeves are like super long and like scrunched up like that. I think it's so cute. But I'm gonna just for the purpose of the video. Make sure I show that it does have thumb holes because I know a lot of girls like that. And then it has this really cute, like, not cut out detail, but it's like, it's the hem or like the seam. And it's like split, super cute. At first I thought it was going to be like crisscross, but it's just supposed to be like this. Super cute. And the color is like a, like a bone, like a pretty... Not even all white, like it has like yellow undertones, like very much like almost cream. It's really pretty. So next shot. Oh, and then the shorts are super cute too. Now if I wrote you a love note. I just wanted to come on here and show you guys this shirt. It's so cute. Um before I change so I love I don't know I love the shade of green but the way it just holds the girls up without needing like a bra or anything and it's the softest material like I'm not even lying love 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 the shirts so okay so I'm officially a Lululemon girl period I feel like um, I don't know if y'all remember, but I definitely got my, um, it's in my closet too. I should show you. Let me, let me actually get it. I got my Lululemon Define jacket or the BBL jacket as everyone calls it on TikTok, um, a few months ago now. And I love it. The only thing is, I feel like, I don't know if I'm washing it wrong or what the situation is it does get a little linty i think just just because of the material and of course it's black so it's going to show um the only thing that i will say that i didn't like about this is that when i dried it the second time or washed it and dried it the second time um this had like i know some girls wear it as a scrunchie but it had like a elastic at the bottom of the zipper and it had the lululemon logo attached to it it broke off in the I want to say in the wash probably not the dryer and so when i got it i just had to cut it off because it was like unraveling and it was just a hot mess um other than that it's still in good shape i always wash it and dry it inside out um now that i learned that so yeah it's super cute i love it um i wear it all the time and it really does give you like that bbo snatched at the waist look so i want to get that in a bunch of colors but girl it's like i think it's like 118 or something like that it's expensive so but anyways i did go shopping again i went back to lemon and i got some stuff i got some really like everything that i get is like trending and kind of like very popular and sells out so yeah i got 
some of their groove pants and if you're not familiar with lululemon because i'm just now getting hit to it um the groove pants are just like basically yoga pants you know the yoga pants from like back in the day that flared out that we would get from victoria's secret and from pink that's basically what this is and the material is different from the jacket but it's um is it i don't know i don't know i know a lot of people are like experts in lululemon and their material and stuff i'm not obviously i'm just now like i said getting hooked to it um so yeah it's just basically like a yoga pant that flares out and it's so flattering they're so comfortable so i got mine in a size both of them in a size six and i got the black as you can see obviously and then i also so initially i got this um like this muted like olive color but it was more like spruce like the name was smoke spruce and it just it was cute but it was just like uh like kind of like a awkward ish looking green and i was fine with it but then they came out with this color last week so i exchanged that color for this color and it's the same groove pant it's not like wide but it's just flared and these are so so fire i haven't tried them on but i mean the color on my skin tone fire um y'all know we all love anything chocolate anything brown so i had to snag these because i knew they were gonna sell out like they had like a a java color i think last year or over the spring and it sold out so i was like yeah let me just grab these and exchange those other green ones because I just I just need two of these. I feel like I don't really need that much. Um, so it was no point in me having three. So I was like, let me just exchange them. So then these are so viral right now on TikTok. Every single girl um, that's like into Lululemon is talking about these freaking belt bags. So I found this one in store. I ordered this one and then I ordered this like white one and it comes today actually it's gonna be delivered to my mom's house so I was like wait these from Lulu Women are going viral like okay period let me get my hands on them girl they're always sold out so the fact that my Lulu Women had this one in stock like the black one um they had the black one they had this one but I had already ordered it they had this green color that's like very popular on TikTok and they had like a silver. I'll probably insert the clip here, but girl, the girls are going crazy over these bags. So I wanna wear mine today because I have on this white shirt and then I have on some um, black um, biker shorts. So I wanna wear it. I've been like waiting to wear it. So I don't really know how today is gonna go. Uh, I gotta call my mom and stuff but yeah i haven't been on camera i haven't vlogged in a couple days because a lot has been going on so yeah um anyway let's see i'm trying to adjust it to see how it'll fit across my chest and girl everywhere i go around my way anyway i see girls with this on like I was at the supermarket yesterday. <laughs> this girl had the black one on. I went to Sprouts another day. A girl had it on. I'm just like, what? This thing is really, really popular. I don't even know how I'm supposed to wear it. I need to go on TikTok and see how the girls have it on. So they wear it like this. I was just trying to figure out if the logo was up or down, but it's down. So yeah. This is cute. Oh my God, this is so my vibe. So my vibe. This is like perfect for just like running errands and when you don't wanna have to worry about a bag, like if you're just going out real quick or I'm gonna be wearing this all the time. Um, let me cut the tag off and I wanna see what all can fit in here. So I figured we could just do that real quick. Um, okay, so this is what the inside, I think I can do a close up, huh? This is what the inside looks like. There's a, maybe I should show you in this color so it's not just like a black hole. But it has a pocket right here, a pocket right here, so two pockets right here. And then just 
one big pocket right here and then just the middle and then it has this little pocket in the back and then this is the this color is i think it's burnt caramel so i figured it would be super cute for fall um so yeah i'm gonna wear the black one so let's see if we all can fit in here all right so i gotta put my cards in my wallet they're um currently just in this front pocket right here so i gotta put them in here so my wallet i guess we'll just go in the middle let me move up so y'all can see so let's say my wallet goes in the middle my hand sanitizer so touchland sent me these cute little hand sanitizers i have another one i don't know where it is oh it's in my um my uh my work bag my tote bag so they sent me these um this one has like a little sleeve on it super cute i'm gonna post a video on tiktok sometime this week um so put this in here i'm gonna just put this is it gonna fit in this pocket yeah i put it in the pocket that's like that has two so yeah i just put it in this one um i don't want to put that one in that sanitizer i also have this one which is probably so dirty i have this one i'll link this one down below this one is so pretty so aesthetic i mean they're both cute it's just that the touchland one is just a lot thicker a lot bigger and i just like how this is like all black and they have different colors in this one so yeah i don't know let me take out i'm gonna take out the touchland one and i'll put this one in just because i feel like it just makes more sense because this bag is already small i don't need like a bigger sanitizer so i'm gonna just put this one in and i'm gonna put it in that same spot oh my god i'm gonna start like so bad yeah this is just so much better okay and then with that i'm gonna just put some more little sanitizers i have these like individual use single use sanitizers from um purell and then I also have a little white sanitizer white. Um, one of them fell. I'm gonna just put that right behind the um, right behind it. I just feel like you can never have. Well, I can never have too much sanitizer. So yeah, tampons because it's that time of the month. My period came on over the weekend, so I'll take two regulars and one light. I love it, these. This just turned into a complete what's in my bag. <laughs> I'm gonna put these in the bigger one. I love these videos though. I don't know if y'all do, but I love watching these on TikTok. Not so much YouTube anymore, but I love these on TikTok. So I just put three of those in there. So, so far we have wallet sanitizer, tampons. I'm gonna put this little tiny baby um, necessary hand oil body lotion but i'm gonna just use it for my hands i'm gonna put that probably in that same pocket with the tampons yeah this is hard how do y'all do this all right so yeah right there um i have my little lysol to go i'm gonna just put that at the bottom right go with my wallet um on my lips this is what i have on my lips right now but just the dior lip oil i'm gonna put that in the other pocket across from the oh my god this is so hard to do what the hell yeah right here in that other pocket across from the sanitizer um my ear pods i guess I can go in here and i just put it in the same pocket with the lip oil and then my batteries for my camera this is so so cute such a vibe so what it feels like nothing is in here i feel like i could tighten it a little bit more but tell me that's not cute yeah i feel like it's too uh i feel like it's not high up enough yeah this is cute 
This is really, really cute. I'm gonna show you in the uh, the full mirror before I leave. But that's so cute. For just run an errand and then you just have your phone in your hand. You don't have to worry about carrying it in your bag or whatever, slinging it over your uh, over your shoulder. Cause that's what I have to do for this. Either like put it cross body or over my shoulder, which is still fine because it's like out of my hands. But I like how this is just on me. You get me? Cute. Let me try on the uh, green one or burnt caramel, should I say? And then um, I'm gonna have to get off camera and pack up my work bag because we're gonna go over there. We're gonna be at my mom's house all day, just waiting for his phone and stuff. So we'll both be getting some work done over there. But oh, this color is so cute. <gasps> Stop it. Do y'all see this? Do y'all see this? Again, on my skin tone, that's fire. I really wasn't too sure about this color, but that is so cute. Like, if I had some different shorts on, I would definitely wear this color today. This is cute as hell. All right, girl, go get you one of these belt bags for the fall, okay? We are carrying it like this, literally fall fall and winter um i wish i had these over the summer even though i didn't really go that many places over summer but this is just such a convenient bag like i can't wait to show you the white one the white one is going to be fired okay let me go actually real quick real quick i bought this fragrance um wrong way sis from ulta it's the fresh cream warm cashmere uh fragrance from philosophy this was also going viral on TikTok, and I, I've already been using it, and it smells so good. It smells like vanilla. It smells like warm vanilla, warm vanilla sugar. Is that what it is? My body works, but just like a little bit more intense, a little bit more grown. It's so good, and this is only, I think, forty six dollars. So definitely a vibe. I got mine from Ulta. If I didn't say that already. I think I did, just in case I didn't. It's from Ulta. Okay, let me go. Um, pack my stuff up and start getting ready to head over there. Also, I should put. Oh no no, no I don't need to put that in. There. Yeah, let me go. Supermarket haul, so Giovanni, of course. I just saw that this has um, what is it? Um, rapeseed oil. So I didn't know that before, and that's kind of kind of disappointing. Um, cause yeah, I just I don't want oil in my oat milk, but I love this oat milk, and I'm trying to figure out how is oat milk healthier or almond milk or any of these other alternatives if they have oil in it like it's bothering me anyway i just saw someone go viral on tiktok talking about all of the like oat milks and um almond milks and everything so now i'm like on higher <laughs> high alert but anyway i got these for the girl that um i got the recipe from on tiktok she uses like a combination of both of these like she makes her own homemade uh sauce but hers is sweet ginger chili sauce. So I was like, well, I'm gonna just combine these two and see what I can get out of it. And then these are really, really good. I just got one for me and then one for Isaiah. He likes this one, I like this one. These are really expensive. These are like $8, but they're really good. Anyway, avocados, raspberries, mint, blackberries, some frozen strawberries, frozen fruit blend, mango for smoothies and then i got this pumpkin brioche twist i'm really excited about this because i've been seeing people talk about it on tiktok so i want to make some french toast out of this and see how it turns out bagels for breakfast sandwiches some tomatoes 
basil bread for avocado toast, um, some pastries for Isaiah to have for breakfast in the morning, some croissants, we both like these, and we have a box in our, um, our freezer already. Um, and then this is for Isaiah, like he likes these for lunch. Um, he likes these for lunch, these little mac and cheese bites and the beef patties, so these are for him. So I can just pop them in our air fryer, all of them, real quick. Um, throughout the week and he'll have like this one day like half of these one day for lunch and then the next day he'll have some of these and then so forth and so on and then we'll just like rotate it out so it's super easy for me um so that i'm not here like chefing up a whole lunch because girl i don't know if i got time for that so the fact that he likes these and they're not the worst things in the world for him it just works out these are for me these are so good i love these so much the pastry bites with feta cheese and caramelized onions i have this with some fake jam and it's so good i just pop them in the air fryer and they're so 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 good um some freshly squeezed orange juice this is my favorite um it's just it's so good i don't like regular orange juice but this the freshly squeezed is amazing mozzarella these little mozzarella balls are fire you even had these from trader joe's they're marinated in like olive oil and they have like herbs and stuff it's so so good and then i saw this i can't even pick it up um this pumpkin body butter so i want to see how this smells and see what the consistency is hitting for see what it's hitting for in general so i'm gonna use this tonight after i get out of the shower and let y'all know and then just some vanilla bean paste because i've never seen this before and this is another thing that was going viral on tiktok so i had to pick it up this little thing like it's so small this was Four ninety nine, five dollars I think. That's I don't know. I don't know if that's good or not for vanilla bean paste, but I just feel like that was kind of expensive. I know vanilla extract is expensive too, so whatever. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. I do have another bag um, over here. I got some beans. So I might make some breakfast some burritos, but then I have another bag with just a whole bunch of produce. So all the corn stuff. ready because we're gonna go to the mall we're gonna go to american dream mall so yeah a little update i i need your help that's why i came on camera not that y'all can help me in real time which y'all know how i feel about that i wish i could talk to me but um let me show you the outfit that i'm wearing i'm not getting like dressed up or anything but like i, I think i said it on here did i say it on here that like I got cup, um, some compliments on my outfit that I wore the other day, the essential skirt and the bodysuit. And it just made me realize, like, I don't be getting dressed other than biker shirts and a crop top. Um, not that what I'm basically wearing is any different, but just looking a little bit more pulled together. Um, I guess, like, a little bit more done up, so I did my makeup. Um, but yeah, like on a regular i would just put on some biker shorts a crop top no makeup hair in a bun and go so anyway since we're going to the mall i figured let's just put on a little a little chill cute outfit so i'm wearing these sweatpants i love i haven't worn them yet but i bought these um around july maybe even june the end of june maybe early i think july like the fourth of july um weekend so it's just these track pants sweatpants from aloe yoga i have the little um it has the logo right here at the bottom kind of like essentials actually i have my sweatpants right here because i had these on earlier um and the like holographic logo like essentials so 
Oh my god, it's kind of the same color too. Similar. So they have the logo at the bottom, but the aloe is on the back and the essentials is in the front. And these have buttons all down the leg, which is why I called them track pants because I think that's the official name. So courtside tear away snap pants. And this is the shade Espresso, and I have a size medium. I also got these in the white shade, and I've been checking, like, every week to see if they come out with, like, new colors. They do have other colors on here, but they're not. Y'all know, they're not for me. They might be for you, but they're not for me. So check them out because, like I said, you might see some other colors on here that you like. Um, so, yeah, I'm wearing these. They have pockets and everything. And they're literally just sweatpants. They're just nicer because it has the buttons going down and it has like almost like a ribbon material. And they are um not wide, but just like looser fitting. So super cute and the buttons go all the way down. And like I said, the shade is espresso. I don't know if you can really see. So my question is, oh, also, I wore this bag today. I don't think I came on camera earlier. I think I just had to, I had some stuff I had to take care of and then I had to go to Target and stuff. So it was like, kind of a lot going on. So I just got dressed and went about my day. So I wore this with this sweatsuit. Like I just, it's crazy because one thing about me and I said it on here before, I don't wear my clothes. Like I don't wear my new stuff. Like I don't know what it is, but I like to just save stuff. And I don't like, I, I like I've had, like I said, I've had these since like July and I have not worn them. Um, so I was like, I'm gonna just wear this bag. I got the bag, I'm gonna just wear it. Usually, I would just <laughs> stick to the one that I already used because, like I said, I hate using my new stuff. But anyway, going off of that, basically, what I'm saying is your girl's ranching out, and I'm gonna wear this one. I have the basics I have the pants, I have the bag, so I need help with the shirt. So I told y'all yesterday that. I didn't really like how it looked up against like stark white shirts and I didn't know what to wear with it um but because I have brown pants I want to wear a white or light shirt you know what I'm saying I don't think my camera is going to show y'all what I'm trying to show y'all you see what I mean like I don't I don't not feeling it up against the white so I also have this top but it's also white um and then I have just like this plain like white beater but it's also white so I was going through my drawer and I found this little tube top um, from H&M. This is like a taupe color. So you see this? This kind of like goes a little bit more with this, if you know what I mean. You get what I'm saying? Like it doesn't wash it out all the way because it's not like a true white. So do I wear this with the pants and the bag? Um, or do I wear this? This is also like a similar taupey like spot on taupey shade so do i wear this but since this has buttons is it gonna look goofy oh it kind of covers the buttons hmm. i don't know so i'm thinking these two one of these two tops are the contenders with the pants and the bag but i need you all to tell me like do you think one of these tops or just go with like a plain white top